For my informant speech, I thought I would talk about palm oil and its effects on the environment. So I thought I would start off by answering the question, what exactly is palm oil? Palm oil may be something that you've never heard of, but it's actually something that you've come into contact with. According to the World Wildlife Fund, palm oil is the world's most widely consumed vegetable oil. Think about that, compared to canola oil or peanut oil, palm oil, something that you've probably never heard of, is actually the world's most widely consumed vegetable oil. It's found in anything from pizza dough to lipstick to soap and to even like stuff like instant noodles. And due to the, uh, the high usage is because palm oil has many properties that other vegetables do not. It's actually very easy to extract the oil from the palm oil fruit and has a much higher yield than other vegetable oils, according to Take Part. And due to these properties, a lot of land is being cleared to make room for palm oil. In 2015 alone, 52,000 square miles of land were converted to palm oil plantations. That is almost four times the size of the country of Switzerland. And because palm oil, the palm oil tree, um, thrives best in tropical environments, a lot of the land that's being cleared is rainforest owned by some unique ecosystems and species. According to Tech Times, in total, palm oil takes up 250,000 square kilometers of land. That is comparable to the size of the state of Arizona and the country of Italy. According to Adam Heiser, a researcher for palm oil, palm oil is the world's largest driver of deforestation and is responsible for 8% of all the deforestation in the world from the years 1990 to 2008. The country that is the biggest producer of palm oil is Indonesia. So no surprise, Indonesia is leading the world in the highest rate of primary forest loss, and which is a tragic thing to say because Indonesia is home to some unique species such as the pygmy elephant, orangutans, and countless other types of species you will only find in the Indonesian rainforest. According to Tech Times again, over half of the forests on Borneo, an island in Indonesia, were lost between the years 2005 and 2015, and they are continu and it's continuing to be lost at a rapid rate. And not only are they losing forests, this forest is home, is an ecosystem to some unique species. According to the IUCN, which is a world leader in wildlife preservation, 54% of threatened mammals and 64% of threatened birds globally are affected by palm oil expansion. Along with that, 10,000 of the last 75,000 to 100,000 of the Borneo orangutan are now at risk to of palm oil expansion. In fact, the areas palm oil is expanding into are home to over two thirds of the world's endangered birds. That means palm oil can be the main driver in losing over two thirds of the world's endangered birds, which is a tragic thing to say out loud. In total, palm oil is affecting at least 193 threatened species on the IUCN Red List of Threatened Species. Palm oil is, one of, is the world's biggest driver in deforestation. However, it is a very useful product in everybody's everyday life. So to continue to use this product, the world must set aside profitability and find a way to create a sustainable farming practice for this great product without affecting the environment in the way it does now.